Hey, hey, my purties. This Pretty Girl Designs by Tasha. This is my inventory. What is left after Mother's Day sale of 2023? I'm very, very happy. I'm very, very pleased. A lot of my uh, subscribers, some of my subscribers, I'm not going to say a lot of my subscribers, like, what did you sell out? No, I did not, sweetie. This is what I have left, okay? I'm in here straightening up my house, cleaning up, doing a deep clean, what's much needed after each season, which is fine with me. Majority of what I have left is big jumbo ones, okay? Them big teddy bear ones and these big teddy bear ones. I'm actually really pleased. That's okay. I'll keep rolling them on to the next holiday. This one I got to fix because it broke which is fine. I'm going to just redo the bow, re-shrink wrap it, call it a day. But yes, this is all I have left. This is all only the last of the inexpensive ones right here, and I got one right there. But I had made several of those, you guys, so this is all. I have one of this flat rate uh, concepts right there, and I got four of them right here. These boxes, I got four, five, six, six, after, uh, I had almost 30 of them things, and I'm happy that they are gone. I did this one a little different. I didn't put a bow on top, you guys. I just did a little bow on the side, used some little sunflowers to try to do. These was a big hit. I had two of them left. I had made 19 of them, okay, and every single one of those sold, every single one of them, because I went back to the store at first i had six and i said uh -uh, i like them so i went and bought more you know what i mean and i ended up with 19 of those honey sunflower ones and they also and i sold them for 35 dollars a piece okay and i wrapped them just like that they was like that's cute that's cute and i had the little sunflower bow these is only two left okay so those are in my stockpile i gotta rework these baskets because they've been with me too uh too long like it didn't sell for valentine's day and these didn't sell for mother's day so therefore i gotta rework those because they're not getting attention you know so i gotta reduce redo some thinking on these baskets right there but other than that i'm pretty pleased all my trunks is so i had created 18 trunks 18 or so i still have a little stockpile of the trunks left who I can use, but I gotta uh probably in the next couple of days I'll be reaching out to my wholesale supplier to uh make uh to purchase 24 more of them. And of course, 24 trunks is five hundred dollars. I had someone to comment on the video, uh said she couldn't hear the price. 24 of those trunks or $500, okay? And they do come from overseas. And you do he do get to let you choose the color contrast, what you want to use. But this room was absolutely full with baskets. I'm finna mop my flows. These are some men baskets, what I have left. I'm gonna start with these. I'm not gonna create so many men's. But I'm going to start with that, and then I'm going to probably add 30 to that pal, and that's going to be the end of Father's Day for me. I'm not going to go all out for Father's Day because Father's Day is not a super big hit, but I do sell on Father's Day, so that's it. But this is what I'm left with, you guys. I think that I did pretty ding dong good. I think I did pretty ding dong good. My bows are smashed. Like yesterday, let me tell y'all a story, then I'm going to get up off this video. I mean, not yesterday, because yesterday was Monday. Uh, Sunday, we it was raining like a tsunami. I said, hey, let's pop this tin up. I popped that tin up, and then I let that U-Haul ramp down, and... We just, I, every uh, client that came up, I said, come on up on the truck. So we served them off the U-Haul, okay? I put I put one table outside of my U-Haul to attract attention, and I put some big baskets, and I made sure that they was really good up under the tent. 
up on, uh, on that table too. I didn't even put a tablecloth on. I actually used my tablecloths on the ramp. I got to wash them today too, you know, because I just threw them in my garage. Because y'all, I passed out. When I came home Sunday, honey, I took a shower. We went to Outback Steakhouse. We did takeout. You know, my kids and them, they chose whatever dinner they want. I had uh, chose the steak. Y'all, I ate one bite of that steak and one bite of them potatoes. And you know something? My body was like, pass out. And I passed out. Do you hear me? I was sleepy. And I slept. I slept. My daughters and them, they seen that I was so tired. You know what I mean? My, I don't know which one of them came and got my plate because I was eating in my room. You know, they came and put, got my plate and put it in the refrigerator for me. Thank you. You know, I was like, thank you. But I had passed out, you guys. You know, I was like, uh, uh, uh. And I was grateful for that. Uh, but this is what I'm left with with my inventory. But I love that U-Haul because two years in a row, it has rained on Mother's Day. That U-Haul saved me. Excuse me, I'm a little sleepy now because I've been up since 3 a.m. getting my house in order, you know, doing a real deep cleaning, something what was much needed from after the holidays because you know how we have uh, a little uh, shred here and there and walking. Uh-uh, it was time to deep clean and I'm finna deep clean my floors, my water. I like, I'm old school. I still, I boil my mop water, even though I have uh, one of those spin mops, I still got to have that. And then I also throw in a Tide Pod, okay? I'm giving y'all a little household tip. I throw a Tide Pod in it and I also use uh, Fabuloso, whichever one I, or Pine Saw, and I mop my floor. I also use Mary Mop Soap in there, right? I put some Mary Mop Soap because my floors are wood, you know, throughout the house, except in the rooms, I have carpet. So, yeah, yeah that's how I'm going to deep clean, and I'm going to steam mop my uh, whole house, you know what I mean, with that. But I boil my water, okay? I like my water to be steamy, but whatever. That's just a little household tip, what pretty girl designs like to do, okay? But with this video, I think I did good for 2024. This is what's left. Not much inexpensive, not too much. I'll take that. So with that being said, please like, share, Comment and subscribe. Have a very good day. Bye.